Hello and welcome. We all know that it is very very difficult to reach decision at time. It is very easy otherwise if you have problem coming from others and you make decision on their part. It is so easy. If the problems are of others then decision comes immediately. If it is ours then it consumes time. Why this is so tricky? Why this is so difficult? Let's understand whether decision making can be learned in isolation. So, decision makers, people who take it, definition, why they are important for us. Let's get into the detail of it. As financial, technical and environmental changes occur, a company may need leaders to make effective business decisions to ensure it continues performing well. Therefore, many businesses have decision makers. They work to determine the best outcome for their company to help it grow and remain successful. In this particular shoot, we explore who decision makers are in a company, why they are important, the type of decision makers each company has and factors that influence their decisions. Who are decision makers in in a company? A decision maker is an employee usually in leadership who makes challenging decisions that impact how the company operates. Employees who are strong decision makers know how to effectively problem solve and use critical thinking skills that help find solutions to problems. They can effectively weigh possible options and decide on the outcome that best benefits the company and its employees. Why are decision makers important in a company? Decision makers are important because their main goals are typically to keep the company functioning efficiently and make decisions that help it continue growing. Decision makers determine larger company decisions and work to keep it efficiently running so other employees can focus primarily on their day-to-day -day projects. Common benefits strong decision makers bring to companies include making sure the company makes correct big picture decisions to keep the business growing. Helping companies choose effective business partners that fund the company and help bring in more profits. Creating effective business and sales strategies to successfully sell their product and services to quality customers and clients. Building marketing and promotional strategies that help the businesses generate new leads and build their brand awareness. Planning policies that ensure the business remains successful and employees feel safe and comfortable in their work environment. The types of decision makers. There are various types of decision makers depending on the industry, company and role they are working in. These may include brand centric. This type of decision maker focuses heavily on their company's brand and how they can improve it. A majority of their decisions resolve around how the decision may impact their image and brand. They also focus heavily on their business's core competencies and work to regularly uphold them. Brand-centric decision makers consider how their decisions impact their customers and the way these customers perceive the business and the brand. When decision makers choose significant decisions, they pose these decisions to their employees as cultural transitions and work to make these transitions positive and beneficial for both customers and team members. Multifocal. Multifocal strategic decision makers aim to focus on multiple outcomes and goals when making important business decisions. They focus both on making larger profits and the way their decisions affect their culture and brand. Multifocal decision makers use trial and error approaches to try new strategies that may benefit their company. They are open to learning about new skills, revenue streams, and business models that may enhance the company's efficiencies. Aggregator. Aggregators usually build their decisions around financial growth and change. 
A lot of their decisions focus heavily on creating strategies to help the business gain new acquisition. They often focus less on choices that affect their company culture and more on financial outcomes. Many aggregators consult with analysts investors and technological systems to help them come to final business decisions. How do decision makers determine the best business choice? Making high level decisions for a company can be challenging and involves a strategic process to ensure it's the best solution for the company. Here are the steps that a decision maker determines what choice to make. Number one define what the decision is strong decision makers carefully analyze the problem or reason they need to make a decision they may identify the decision on their own or approach other members of the leadership team to analyze and discuss the problem they must solve number two collect important information once they know what decision to make, they gather information both internally and externally about the issue they are trying to solve. This information is a mixture of what they already know about the problem and from conducting research using books or online sources. They may also gain knowledge from other business professionals or colleagues to help with the decisions. Number three. Determine what the alternatives could be. After researching the problem and better understanding it, the decision maker may now uncover possible solutions to the problem. They use this time to list out all the solutions they think might be ideal to effectively solve the problem. Number four, imagine the outcome for each option. When they lay out all the options, the decision maker can analyze them further to predict the outcome each may bring. They think about possible scenarios and determine how well each one solves the issue and meets the company's overall goals. This helps the decision maker realize which ones they think are the best decisions and may list each possible decision based on which they favor the most. Number fifth, decide which option would be the most effective. After they weigh all the evidence, they select the solution that brings the most benefits to the company. They may even decide what a combination of the possible options from the previous step may be the most effective strategy. Number six, follow through by taking action. Once they make the decision, they can follow through with it. The decision maker determines what they need to do to carry out the decision and will start taking action and implementing the change or transformation for the company. Number seven, ensure the decision is most effective. The decision maker can now watch as the decision plays out and see the changes taking effect. This will also be a significant moment for them to witness the reactions from others in the company and the financial changes that may possibly occur. They may need to make consistent changes to respond to the effects the overall decision may cause. Factors that influence decision makers when making an important business decision, there are various factors that may affect the choice of decision maker selects. The following factors may influence how decision makers determine their choice. Number one, group size. If decision makers are collaborating in a group to make significant choices for the business, the size of their group may be vital. Smaller groups often give each member a better chance of being heard and may allow the group to have discussions in a more intimate setting. This can more easily help them all come to a more efficient and well-informed decision. Physical and mental health. 
when making important decisions decision makers should ensure they are taking proper care of both their brain and body a healthy mind allows the brain to think more easily and a healthy body makes energy levels flow well to allow creative problem solving to occur decision makers can practice strong mental and physical health by eating healthy foods each day and receiving approximately 6 to 8 hours of sleep every night so it isn't that easy but it is also not that mechanical you just need to follow few nuances few good things and practice it over a period of time decision makers emerge but primarily you need to follow it very closely and maybe earn that leadership to become a decision maker hope you must have got all of it if yes then get going and be a decision maker best wishes and thank you